Hi everybody, I'm Colleen McRae Katz. Welcome back to my kitchen again. Today I'm going to be making a dessert and I've named it Black Forest Mousse. It's a twist on chocolate mousse and we're going to be using the whipped Philadelphia cream cheese. No flavorings or anything like that in it. It's just an 8 ounce tub of whipped Philadelphia cream cheese. And you start with one cup of semi-sweet chocolate chips in your blender and then you take your tub of the cream cheese and I use the, the entire 8 ounces of the whipped cream cheese You put that in the blender this comes together really quickly and it sets up in no time at all from start to finish just like Paula wants us to do in the rules one hour So. Excuse me, Crystal. Okay, we'll keep this out so we know who our wonderful sponsors are. Okay. And you take one cup of heavy cream, you heat it. Mm, it's not quite done yet. So I'll let that go for a second. You take one cup of heavy cream and heat it till it's just bubbling there. Then I also take one three ounce package of black cherry jello and I dissolve it with just a half a cup of boiling water just enough to get it get the powder to dissolve Pour this in over the chocolate chips and the cream cheese. And here we go. Cream is ready. Pour this down in there. And this helps everything to melt. And then you add one teaspoon of vanilla extract. and two whole eggs. The lid on and let it go. tell you, you're going to impress your company with this dessert. It's delicious and they're never going to know it was so quick and easy. And so what I like to do is serve it in like, you know, something fancy to make it really look special because it tastes so good. Um, so I put it into some wine glasses, fill them up, you know, two thirds of the way or so, because we're going to top it off with some homemade whipped cream. We're going to pipe some of that on top. And you saw how fast that came together, so this gives you plenty of time for it to set up. Excuse me. Another little wine glass in here somewhere. Oh, there we go. Don't want to waste any of this. It's too good. Okay. So you can get a little over four servings out of that batch. And I'm just going to clean up my glasses here before I, before I put them in the refrigerator. Because you want them to look pretty. And I make some homemade whipped cream with it. With the, you know, I, I buy a pint of uh, of the heavy cream. I'll bring up the refrigerator now. And um, I use half of it for this, and the other half to make my homemade whipped cream. And pipe it on top with my pastry bag, and it just looks so special and so 
so festive. I just love it and it's delicious. Okay. So now they're all in there. Mm. Move you over here. Just let them set. So that's it for now. Um, and whipped cream is pretty easy, straightforward. You just use heavy cream and some confectioner sugar and whip it for about five minutes. That will be in my recipe as well. So I'm going to let this sit and when I come back we're going to pipe the uh, whipped cream on top and get it all plated up. See you soon. Hello everybody, welcome back to my kitchen. I'm so excited for this dessert to be done. I am a chocoholic from the word go. I love it. And right now I just want you to see I made some whipped cream. Making fresh whipped cream is as easy as it gets. This is one cup of heavy whipping cream, a half a cup of confectioner sugar in a chilled bowl. Whip it for five minutes, that's it. Now I have some cake decorating stuff around because I took a cake decorating course a few years ago, but it's really easy and inexpensive to get a pastry bag and a tip. This is a, about a medium sized star tip. The Wilton things are readily and inexpensively available at your craft stores like Michael's. And you'll use it a lot because I know people use it to, um, to pipe their, uh, their uh, deviled eggs and, and just make things look nice and pretty when you're presenting them, plating them up. So I just fill my pastry bag up, squeeze it down, and I have my timer going because they've been in the refrigerator for 50 minutes, 5-0-50. Um, to set up so that you know that everything can be done. Huh? I just opened a refrigerator door right in front of the camera. Okay. <laughs> everything can be done in an hour and as you can see, nice and solid. So we'll bring out a couple. And we're going to pipe some, excuse me guys, pipe some of our fresh whipped cream right on top. I love whipped cream, so I go around a couple of times and bring it up. And these, this is easy. Look how quick this is. Oh, and it just looks so special. So I took them out ten seconds before the <laughs> timer went. Um, So like, I don't know, if your husband calls and says he's bringing his boss home for dinner or something, you can get this together really quickly. Now again, I'm a chocoholic, so I would even put some chocolate chips on top just to add a little more chocolate because I love it. So I'm going to get a spoon because I can't wait any longer to taste this. And I like to get some whipped cream and I have one chocolate chip on there too. Mm. It is divine. It is absolutely heavenly. I hope that you try it and you enjoy it and come back and join me in my kitchen again sometime. Bye bye.